Okay. There's five artifacts in total. But this is why you should read the instructions in full before you start. You cannot take this. We were apparently supposed to look at the position of the artifacts before we took them out. Which we didn't do. We just got and excited and took to them all out. So we made a couple of little errors here for not reading all the instructions. Um, apparently the position of the artifacts is noted too and it means something. So a real archaeologists would notice the position of everything as well. But yeah, that was our excavation of the pyramid. Natalia, yeah. you need to come here for a second, honey. Yeah. So I want you to review the kit. Okay, Natalia is busy there, but the rest of the kit has different experiments. How to mummify an apple, what is archaeological science, surveying the site, um, gridded excavation site, how to put a grid on an excavation site, um, more excavation activities. Oh, that one looks cool. Carbon 14 Half-Life. You need 80 pennies, a shoebox, and a pencil and paper. Carbon-14 is used to estimate the age of artifacts. This is one we should do, Natalia. This looks cool. Carbon-14 half-life. Carbon dating is how they know how old something is. And then there's a section on analysis of carbon dating and displaying your discoveries. And a pyramid model. And Dominic sounds severely upset. Dominic just got a new bike. It's just today, a brand new bike, and Daddy just made him put his brand new bike in the garage. And I can hear him crying from here. Well, I didn't But, okay, Tally, Natalia, grab the box, show the box, and I want you to give a review of what you liked and what you didn't. Can you guys give us two minutes here? We're almost done. I can't, I'm sorry. Daddy and Dominic came home and Daddy saw what we're doing and he added a cool little fact that we did not know. What were you saying, Daddy? In these little things here that they had, it was made of clay. And they used to put the insides of the mummy, like the kidneys or the livers or stuff or their favorite pets. If they had pets. Why did they birds. feel the need to preserve their insides too? Because it's all to the afterlife, right? Mm, they needed their insides for the they afterlife. Everything in there, including their pets. Right, I heard about the pets before. Yeah. And one of those little artifacts looks like a dog, and one looks like a cat. Yeah, that's what they put in here, so they can Very take cool. Them in. So, little lady, what did you think of the archaeological? Archaeological, I can't say that word, archaeology, there we go, archaeology, pyramid dig from National Geographic. I loved it. You loved it? What did you like about it? Two things you liked about it, your favorite things. Digging and finding those little figures and solving the hieroglyphics. Hieroglyphics. Good job. And was there anything you didn't like about it? Nope. Nothing? Nothing. No, no constructive criticism? No. Nothing, eh? Well, no, if anybody... Just one. What's that? But I didn't really hate it, but I didn't like doing it. Is getting the part, this part off. Right, that was a little tough. But once it came off, it was, it was relatively easy to get the rest off. And... It's supposed to leave those M and... Can you pass me that book there? this wherever it was to lock it right that was a, we made two little mistakes because we didn't read the instructions fully we pulled off the part we were supposed to leave on to lock and we didn't note the position of the artifacts but the cool thing about the manual that comes with it is there are more experiments and we flipped through them already but there's even when you're done with your pyramid there's other things to do in here. So this is going to keep yeah. us busy for a little while. Yeah, that's probably all through summer. Yeah. Summer. So if anybody wants to do a study on ancient Egypt, we would highly recommend the pyramid dig. It was a really cool activity. There's lots of learning things in it. 
And the other book that we really liked, and you can find this on Amazon. I will post a link on Amazon for Amazon. And um, if anybody is interested, we got it from Amazon. And the other book that we had a lot of fun with was the Everything Kids, Mummies and Pharaohs and Pyramids, Puzzle and Activity Book. Pharaohs is a quite weird word. It's yeah. real sad. Okay, don't, don't throw that on my floor, please. But yeah, that was a super cool book as well. Tons of puzzles, activities. We learned a little bit of everything out of there. And we have one more book. Natalia, can you hold this for a minute? Don't, don't get all shaky. Keep nice and steady and just hold it. I will be back in two seconds, okay? This is a really like Yeah. I just wanted to show everybody this book. This book as well. Great ancient Egypt projects that you can build yourself. Um, do you remember when we made the little doll? I can't remember the name of the little doll out of soap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can't remember the name of the doll, but okay. there are a lot of cool projects in this one too. Kept us busy for a lot of the grade two year. So are you happy that you chose ancient Egypt for studying? Yeah. I think so too. It was a very next cool thing. Next is Africa. You want to do Africa next? Very cool. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Well, the cat is the way the mice will play. What are you doing, Dominic? Mm -hmm. Are you excavating the pyramid? Yeah. Good thing sister's not here. She'd probably give you heck. Oh, <laughs> hey, we didn't know you were there. No, no Dominic's just checking it out. It's good. He seeing if there's them. any other treasures in there. Maybe the one from before, the there's person who excavated before. I thought you were in the bedroom. Place. No. Let him do it. Let yeah, do it. he was doing really well with that. Oh, you can see the dust flying again. Slow, slow, slow. There slow you and go. careful. Good yeah, job. Very gentle. And try real hard not to get it on mommy's floor, okay? Do you think there's more Egyptian artifacts in there? Do you think you'll find something? It's yeah. fun for everyone, right, Dominic? Mm -hmm. If big brother or sister lets you touch it, right? That is the hard part. Well, maybe the last archaeologist missed something in there. Maybe. Right? maybe you can find something else. Daddy found a bone yesterday. He did? Yeah. And from a bone. the dinosaur. Oh, the dinosaur bones, yes. Let's see the a missing leg bone or something. The last that did the last excavation forgot one piece there. Dominic, look at me and smile. Very nice. Thank you. If you turn it this way, you can see the inside of the pyramid. There. And it has a lid. You can put the lid on or take it off. Close your eyes for a minute. Close your eyes. Oh, is there anything in there? Did you find anything? What's in there? Artifacts! Yay! A little bit of sand. Good job, baby. So you're the builder of the pyramid. Your sister is the one that brings them in. That sounds about right. <laughs> oh, oh. Opa. Well, I guess you were drunk when you built the pyramids, eh, buddy? What happened? Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. See, that's what happens when you build stuff and you get drunk, eh? Oh, he oh, needs the glasses, oh, right? Oh, of course. Gonna have to, uh, Need that safety glasses. gear. Yeah, Good job. Good thinking. Fix them for you, buddy, so they can fit. Yeah. Good thinking. Your eyes. Yeah, your eyes. Your eyes. Your, your nice little tiny head. Eh? That guy doesn't have any nails here, but I'm sure we'll figure something out. Whoa, Daddy fixed your glasses? Mm -hmm. Nice. Now you're all ready to excavate. 
Good job. You know what else you're missing, Dominic? Mm -hmm. Because of the heat and the pyramids. No, 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 put them on. They use hats to dig because of the heat. So you wow. got to you you use your hat, buddy. Yeah. See, now look at mommy. Look at me. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, You're all yeah. ready to go out in the heat. That's awesome, bud. All ready. Oh, wow. Good job, little man. What are you finding? What is that? A little doll? Nice. The drunk builder, he fell off while he was building the pyramid there, eh? <laughs> Good thing you didn't get hurt. Are you okay? <gasps> Your pyramid's all together. Good job. High fives. High five. And a pound it. Beautiful, baby. I'm so proud of you. Good job. Okay, can you say bye? Bye-bye. Bye-bye.